A nurse informed a client that Papa Nicolau's smear will be done at the next scheduled clinic. To provide instruction to the client regarding preparation for this test, which statement by the client indicate an understanding of the procedure? A. If I have my period at the time of my next scheduled visit, I will not be able to have the test done. B. I need to restrict fluid on the day of the test. C. The test is painful and will cause cramping. And D. I need to do vaginal douching with vinegar and water on the morning of the appointment. So basically, the question here is, if a person uh, is doing uh, pap smear or Papa Nicolau, um, what happened is, what will you tell the, the patient or what is expected? So the answer is number letter A. So if I have my period at the time of my next scheduled visit, I will not be able to have the test done. So, a nurse, okay, I'm going to repeat the question. A nurse informed a client that Papa Nicolau's smear will be done at the next scheduled clinic visit uh, and provide instruction to the client regarding preparation of this test. Which statement by the client indicate an understanding of this procedure? So basically, when the patient said, if I have my period at the time of my next schedule visit, I will not be able to under, uh, have the test then. So just remember, when you will have a Papa Nicolau test or a pap smear, uh, you cannot do it during menstruation. B is not an option because I... It says here, I need to restrict fluid on the day of the test. You don't need to restrict fluid on the day of the test for Papa Nicolau. C is not an option too. The test is painful and will cause cramping. So it means that it doesn't, it's not going to be painful. The pap smear and uh, the Papa Nicolau test won't be painful. D is not an option too. I need to do vaginal douching with the vinegar and water on the morning of my appointment. So you don't have to do uh, vaginal douching, uh, douching with vinegar and water. So the best thing is, just remember, you cannot do it when um, you have menstruation. I'm learning about something else. So the rationale, remember, is a Papa Nicolau smear cannot be performed during menstruation. The test is usually painless. The client need to be instructed to avoid douching for 24 hours prior to the test. So remember, avoid it. Don't do douching. There is no reason to restrict fluid on the day of the test. So, so the test taking strategy in here is eliminate option two first as unlikely preparation to measure. Although the client may be asked to urinate prior to the test, eliminate option four next to douching. So just remember also that the client may need uh, may be asked to urinate prior to the test in the way they want to. Uh, So that's the test, and this is uh, Papa Nicolau test. So this is how they do it. They smear it and uh, they put it on. 
cheek tip. Can I put it on my finger? So, so this is a Bob smear. No, it's not. Oh. You can Hope you learned something. This is going to be an Unclex question.